at the awesome craftsmanship, you know, just high quality build, high quality build, just, you know, awesomeness. That's actually water damage, you know, nothing to see here. I quit. I don't know. Welcome back guys. In today's video, we are going to prep the van to take it to La Mesa for some warranty work. If you remember on one of our previous videos, we actually tried taking it there and long story short is they had to get the pre-approval from Thor so that they could make the repairs. We got that and an appointment. It only took a couple of months. We need to get this thing ready so we can drop it off. So let me empty out the van and I'll show you all the repairs that they're supposed to make. Clearly that needed to be cleaned out. So this is our custom mattress that I got. <laughs> Made by Mr. Bob. So one piece and another piece. You don't need any help. No help needed. I got it. <laughs> all right, now that I have the van emptied out, let me show you all of the places that they are supposed to fix or we expect them to fix. We'll see. First, this wallpaper here, as you can see, it's coming up, looks pretty terrible. All the way down here at the bottom, at the top, just looks like junk. Do you think they can fix that? I do. I think that they'll be able to pull this piece off, re-glue it down, and then basically secure everything back on the face. This one's going to actually take quite a bit of time to do it and make it look nice, but should be easy to do, just time consuming. So this one, as you've seen in a previous video, what cabinet? The cabinet where the dishes are has come out. Literally actually has fallen down, but it is falling apart as well. As you can see, this piece right here, the glue is coming off. It's actually started to like shrink and contort, but that's on the list of things to repair today. I don't know if this is gonna come as like a whole panel that they can replace or if it's just the wallpaper. So we'll have to wait and see, but like this one is actually like a, a panel that can detach. I actually screwed it down because, well, it's a piece of junk. So moving on to up here, you can see this is very common in all of our cupboards. Oh, it's just this side. This wallpaper stuff that they put on just keeps peeling off. So in here, this one's really bad. You can see it's like almost completely off. Just terrible. And then it's also way back here. There's another piece. I don't know if we can see it. It's all coming apart. Here's a little pro tip. I bought these little rubber stoppers and stuck them on the ends of the doors so that in the middle of the night, because they have these hinges that when they come down, there's like resistance. And then once you get to a, like the break point, it slams shut. But you put these little rubber stoppers here. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> and it prevents it from like being super loud. Now it's not quiet, but it's much better. <laughs> That's not how they close. <laughs> What is this? <laughs> oh, so nice. <laughs> Didn't even what? need the stoppers. Wait a second. When did they start doing that? Because in the middle of the night, these have been closed several times and it's like bang and it's so loud. I quit. I don't know. <laughs> I, I solved a problem that it didn't exist, apparently. Okay. All right. Well, moving on to actually something that is broken. This wonderful cabinet, same thing. This back panel, this piece here in the front. Did you see that? Like, that's crazy. Yeah. This piece is all coming off. This is coming off. Just, you know, awesomeness. And the same thing in this panel. So this one's coming off. And that one. All right, so. let's see if they'll slam. Whatever. I don't know if they're going to fix this. I don't know if they saw this or not. That's actually water damage from when our water tank 
they left the valve or the one of the fittings loose and it leaked on the ground. That's where that came from. Um, but look I at think... this bubble right here. Do you think yeah. they'll fix that? I honestly bubble, don't know. Bubble. Okay. The great thing, oh. Bob, is by the time we get everything fixed, it'll be like a brand new van. It's true. I mean, we're almost at that point. Oh, right here too, all that. I don't I don't think this was on the schedule to fix, which is fine because you can't ever see this part, but yeah. the bed just sits on top of it. But this makes sense from the bed just resting on it, kind of grinding. Yeah. So we'll see. So let's check on our water tank. Yep. Everything is still there. <laughs> Nothing's leaking. Nothing it's empty leaking. though. Yeah. Don't you think they should have put one of those access panels over here? Well, they kind of did. So on this side, we have this awesome oh, storage, that's right. which is absolutely useless, especially the way that we utilize our bed. We make our bed and then we just leave it here. So if you put something in here, it's nearly inaccessible. So kind of maybe pointless. like that could be for like valuables. So we could tell everybody that's where we keep our money. Right. This is where we keep our money. <laughs> I just got so much of it. We hide it under the mattress. Uh. This, you just inspecting? This, I'm just inspecting, you know. It's the monthly, like, make sure everything's still yeah. connected. I mean, it's the monthly, like, look at the awesome craftsmanship, you know, just high quality build, high quality build, you know. Nothing to see here. Actually, I probably do want to check this to make sure, like, it's not moving. Okay, like, my work is still staying together. <laughs> back at the Mesa, dropping off the van where you need to check it in so that we can have them repair all of the wallpaper. And it'll be one critical thing we need to find out is how long this is going to take because we need to get back on the road. So we dropped off the van at La Mesa with David. We walked through the entire van with him. He put little pieces of blue tape on all of the items that need to be fixed. We talked to him and it sounds like they're gonna start working on it on Monday, which means we should have it back hopefully on Wednesday. He which, said he'll give us a call by Wednesday because we told him we were going out of town. Yeah, well, I actually thought he was gonna give us a call on Tuesday oh. with the hope of having it done on Wednesday. Okay. So Tuesday, he'll give us a heads up of where we're at. Okay. And then if we can pick it up, that would be amazing because we need it badly. He seemed to be pretty dang positive and like excited that it's going to get done. And he said it's going to look better than the original. Awesome. I know. I didn't hear him say that, but he I'm, told me that. I'm excited to hear that. Yeah. I see that. He said they do really, really good woodwork and, and wallpaper work. So we'll see. Nice. I nice. believe it. Well, <laughs> do you believe it? I believe they can. You believe in them. I'm, I'm, have, I'm, I'm trusting that they're going to do a good job. <laughs> I'm excited to see it when it yeah, gets done. So yeah. I can't lie about that. I mean, we always go into this really positive anyways. Yes. And, and then come out let down. I mean, that's <laughs> been the past, the, yeah. the cycle. So. Yeah. Yeah. So we're believing the best, but yeah. So it's dropped off and we have about four or five days until we can go get it, hopefully, because they know we're actually going out of town. Have a trip planned. Yep, so, hmm, we'll see. All right, the next time you see me, I should be in the van. And it would be all nice and fixed. Better be all nice and fixed. We have some good news for you guys. At least we hope it's good news. <laughs> we got the call. The van is ready. Mr. Lemon should have brand new wallpaper all installed. Fingers crossed they did a good job. I know we haven't had good luck in the past, but I don't know. Something in me tells me they're gonna do a good job. All right, we are back at La Mesa. We are here. One hour later. We just toured everything they did here. Uh, David from La Mesa took us through, showed us all their work and it looks good. They did everything they were good. supposed to. They did everything they were supposed to. 
I'm curious to see how things shake out once we start driving on, you know, bumpy roads and everything else. Yeah, because and, they fixed the cabinet right here that was falling down, yes. plus the wallpaper. Yes. So not only did they fix the like decorative, right? All the wallpa wallpaper was peeling because of, I think heat and just, and honestly just glue going bad. Yeah. I think they just didn't use the right glue. Right, I think there was some issue, kind of the combination of, you know, bad glue plus the heat. Yeah, so didn't. anyways, the wallpaper failed or the glue failed. So they fixed all that and they fixed the cupboard. So let's just, walk you through and show you what they fixed. All right, we'll start with this panel. Looks really nice. This one had lots of wrinkles in it where they had cut out for the fire extinguisher, but they have replaced that. It all looks really, really nice and new and everything looks nice and tight. This actually does look much better than when you purchased it. Yeah, it does. Up here. These panels. They were peeling, if you remember. And one thing I do notice, they did like a little, I don't know if it's caulking or glue, but kind of in the corner. So it all looks very nice and tight. So hopefully, even if you do have any sort of heat issues or expansion and contraction, that glue or, or caulking will help keep things nice and, and tight. And uh, Under here. That panel, yep. again, looks all really nice. Yep, it was falling down. And tight. And then under here. So this one had like a secondary panel inside of it with some trim around it. They've replaced that and glued it down or caulked the edges. So that looks much better there. Oh yeah, was. And both of these panels, oh. again, it's kind of the same thing. They've replaced the panels, everything looks nice and tight. And what I noticed is they've got this trim on in here, so it's kind of behind. Like they the added seam that. is behind the, this panel. So hopefully it will keep it secure. So moving back here, you can see these two cabinets, they've replaced both end caps kind of with the same thing. They've caulked the edge. They've got some new strapping here to hold it down. And this was all peeling up. Yes, and they did a really nice job of fixing this edge here. They secured everything down, made it look really, really nice. And then over here should be the same thing. Same thing. Both end panels are secured. Everything looks nice and clean, secured. And then and one bonus item. Bo bonus item which we weren't even expecting they fixed this trim piece here in the bathroom they fixed this piece here they changed that made it look all nice and uniform because it and we didn't even tell them about it but they said they noticed that it was all wrinkling yeah it was looking it was looking pretty rough and i had noticed it it wasn't a huge deal because you couldn't really see it. it was inside the bathroom but now it looks much better hey they did a bonus item. Like, who saw that coming? I certainly didn't see that coming. And then they also fixed one last thing. Yes. Which we we didn't know we had this issue until we got here yeah, on when, Saturday. When we dropped it off, this was actually loose and hanging down, which made me a little nervous because, you know, it did fly open while we were driving down the highway. But they were able to secure it and everything is looking good. Yeah. After we went over all of this and kind of said, hey, it looks good. We gave them our next list of things to fix, <laughs> which yeah. I will show you. If you guys remember, I'll take you back here. Take you back here. Do you guys remember that episode where Bob breaks this? Yeah, we asked him and we said, we'll even pay for that because we broke it. I'm not for sure how the warranty works. If it works, if we break it, who cares? Both sides are broken, courtesy of Bob, and they really need to get fixed because do you see all that dust? Our air conditioner is really dusty right now. Okay, so we got that on order now. And then down here, they are going to replace this whole thing because when they came and fixed our water, water, what? Jug? Water tank. Water tank. Uh, remember, uh, they didn't tighten it. We didn't know that. It spilled a ton of water and we got some water damage. So that's on order now. They're gonna fix that. I mean, let's be honest. It's going to take a few more months for us to get back in here probably, but it's fine. We just got At least it. we'll get the process started yeah. and the ball rolling. Yeah. So that, and then the last thing we asked them to fix is up here. They've already fixed this before. They've already fixed this before, but they're, they said all the vans uh, that have this are having this issue. So now they put a button right here. So they're ordering the buttons so that they'll button it down um, because I guess that's an issue. But yeah, so, but that's it guys. So far so good. One of these days, we're not gonna be able to call Mr. Lemon, Mr. Lemon anymore. Okay, that 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 is a wish, I hope. 
Maybe we can start calling him Lemonade. <laughs> yeah, we're making... We're look making at, lemonade out of no, our lemons? No, no. We're making... Lemons out of lemonade? No, lemonade out of lemons? Lemonade out of lemons. Yeah, yeah I don't know. Something. I don't know. Something like that. But the funniest thing is, is that they would have seen this as they were fixing it. Mm -hmm. But, hey, now we're zero days, one. zero days. No, one day. Oh, yeah, now today we can would do... be Today is the first day. Okay, okay. Thanks for coming along uh, this journey of getting Mr. Lemon back to new? new, better? Almost new. Yeah. So we're closing this video out saying, good job, La Mesa. Good job. Yeah. Thank you for doing good work. It looks good. And we'll see you back here next week. <laughs> Hopefully not next week. Not here. Next not week. Here. We'll see you guys next week. Yes. We'll see them in a couple weeks once they get everything approved. Yeah. Yeah. But catch you on the next video. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.